Once upon a time, there was a boy without any letters to show his fraternity pride. One day, this boy had a great idea. I'll go over to somethinggreek.com and buy the most perfect shirt ever. The boy chose his size, color, letter pattern, and border, but then something went horribly wrong. What is this? What do I do? I don't want to write out my organization. I just want my Greek letters. So the boy called something Greek. Good evening, thank you for something Greek. This is your fairy godmother speaking. How may I help you? She went on to explain how he should always write out his entire organization to avoid any confusion and delay. In that case, what you would do is you would write out the Greek letters in English words. She said, if you want the Greek letters sigma nu, you should write out the words sigma nu and it will appear just as it is in the example. Writing just letters can cause confusion. If you write the letter P, meaning rho, it could mean psi or phi. Is there anything else that I can help you with today? Have a great evening. <laughs> so the boy ordered his shirt and patiently waited for a phone call. On the day his shirt was ready, he was so excited, he put it on right in the store. The boy and his new letters lived happily ever after. SomethingGreek.com